What? What, what, what? What the hell is this? Harumph, 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 harumph. I didn't get a harumph out of that guy. Give the governor harumph. Harumph. You watch your ass. I see you shiver with anticipation. Let the show begin. Hey, hey, everybody, this is David Heretic coming at you with another edition of Reactions, Reviews, and Rants. And tonight... Tonight. Okay, making their debut on the channel tonight. Tonight. We have Viridia. Yes, indeed. How about that? Viridia making their debut on the channel. Before we go any further, for those of you who are feeling inclined to doing all the clicks and the likes and the bibbity boobity bop, do me a favor, before you do all that stuff, please watch the whole video first, okay? Give me a chance to actually earn those clicks and likes. Now, after the video's done, if you still feel like doing all those clicks and likes, then by all means, Feel free to click away. This comes as a request from John C. And John wanted to see me react to this song by Viridia called We Are the Brave. Don't clench. Don't clench. You're so brave. You're so brave. A little more. Now, have I heard the song before? No, I have not. To the best of my knowledge, this does not resonate with me in any way, shape, or form. However, there's always a possibility I may have heard the song in passing and I just don't realize it. So as always, if I start listening to the song and I suddenly go, wait a second. Yeah, I've heard this song before. I'll let you know. That's the truth. You know me, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. This was posted by Viridia, okay? And the video has 864,000 views. It'll get you there. Other than that, there's really nothing else left to say. Link to the original video will be down below in the video description for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. Let's get started. What do you say? Are you ready? Are you ready? Because here we go. All right, here we go. Viridia, We Are the Brave, official audio. Wah, wah, wah. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Yeah, there's that word official coming off of their official page. Oh boy, here we go. Look, you know what I'm gonna say, so I, I'm not gonna say it, okay? All I'm gonna say is we're gonna have to just wait and see what happens and hope for the best. All right, let's do this. All right, boy, let's do this. So far, so good. Um, I don't hear anything that's blowing my mind, but at the same time, I don't hear anything I'm disliking either. Uh, no, it, everything is solid across the board. Uh, guitar playing sounds good. Keyboard sounds nice. Uh, the drumming sounds solid. Vocals are good. Uh, I like what's happening vocally. Um, yeah, I mean, it. it's... It's nothing that I, I'm gonna ever sit here and go, oh my gosh, this is impressive. I'm not gonna say that, but it's, I, I don't have anything negative 
I don't hear anything negative. So I don't have anything negative to say. I don't have any criticisms. Uh, it sounds just fine across the board. Let's keep going here. I get it. It's the end of the song. It's fine. I'm just glad they didn't overdo it. Um, yeah, it's a solid song across the board. I, I, I don't have any complaints. Um, at the same time, I'm also not going to sit here and blow things out of proportion and go, you know, like a lot of other reactors doing. Oh, my God, this is amazing. No, it's not amazing. It's definitely not amazing. But it's not bad. It's not bad. Um... Let me get my thoughts together. I'll see you in the review, and we'll talk about it. Well, there you go, folks. That was Viridia with We Are The Brave. This was a request from John C. Okay, um, I got my thoughts together, and honestly, there's not a lot to talk about. Once I figured everything out, I was gonna say, I was like, wow, that all, that all clumps together, and that all clumps together, and that all clumps together, so. There really is not going to be a whole lot to be discussed here, so we may have a pretty short review here. Let's start off with the score first. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give that a 6.8. Yep, 6.8. I feel good about that score. Let me tell you why. Why? Okay, first things first. The 6.8. What does that mean? Well... A 6.8 would translate to a pretty good scale rating, so I think it's a pretty good song. It would translate to 3 out of 5 stars and a B letter grade. Not a, not a D, not a C, a B. B is in boy. So there you go, a 6.8, pretty good scale rating, 3 out of 5 stars, and a B letter grade. Now, how did I come up with this score? <laughs> so glad you asked. Um, Simple song, very simple song. Uh, it, it's not it's not super impressive when it comes to the songwriting or the arranging or the mixing or anything like that But at the same time, they didn't do anything bad either. They didn't do anything wrong. They didn't do anything that stuck out like a sore thumb um, No, everything sounded like it made sense. Everything sounded good. Everything was pleasing to the ear uh, It was full sounding which I really appreciated uh, a lot of layers, which I always appreciate as well um Really good engineering job, honestly. It sounded it sounded pretty clear for having all the layers. It, that, that, that sounded all right. Um, the guitar playing, nice. Very well done. I like the guitar tone. Nice, thick, crunchy guitar tone. Um, I don't know if they have an actual dedicated bass player. I really didn't hear bass in the mix. I believe what I was hearing might have been keyboard. So 
they may be one of these bands that have you know vocals guitar keyboard and drums and the keyboard player takes care of the bass part with the left hand it very well could be that um and that's fine i mean that that's that's totally fine if they want to stay a four piece and just keep it to that instrumentation and make the bass player's uh job on the left hand of the keyboard nothing wrong with that i've seen the bands do that before too uh the keyboard playing sounded nice i i had no issue with what i was hearing there um vocally very well done I, I think probably the most impressive thing about the song were the vocals uh coming out of the second verse when she went up uh and hit that high note and held the high note and sustained that was nice i i gotta say that definitely got my attention uh probably in all honesty the most impressive thing about the song okay um it, like I said, it, it's nothing that I'm going to sit here and blow out of proportion and say, you know, and pretend like I was super impressed. Because I, I wasn't. I've heard a lot of bands that play a lot of songs that sound just like this. So I'm, I'm not going to sit here and pretend like I'm blown away. But at the same time, I don't have any complaints. I don't hate it. I, I don't have any reason to hate it. It did everything right, you know, as far as, you know, what I look for in, in a good song. The thing that really kind of caught my attention, the thing that I, I enjoyed the most about the song uh was the the main riff the uh that that the triplet riff well not really a triplet it's more like a six uh like a six eight feel uh the jun 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 over the four though it was, it, it was in four four time the whole time it never changed uh time signature but you had that that triplet feel but it's it's not actually a, tri a triplet would be you know triple the triple the triple the triplet like one to the one to the one to the one to the within each beat so every beat would get three. This was every two beats getting three. So it's more like a six eight feel. Um, but those that that subdivision work really nice. Jun 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 jun. I liked it. I like that. That was the thing that honestly I enjoyed the most out of the entire song was that 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 six feel. Um, the ending. I know a lot of people want because I've always I've I've been very critical of bands who use vocal effects. The the thing is. I've always said this so with, with bands with bands I've been critical of for using vocal effects. I don't have a problem with vocal effects. As long as there's a reason for it, it's needed. Like if, if it actually helps enhance the song, if it serves a purpose, and it's not overdone. This was not overdone. They saved it for the very end. And I have no problem with that. It, it, it really helps kind of put the exclamation part on the uh, at the end of the song of this is it. It has that, that feeling of finality. And I like that. I, I think it worked out just fine. If they had done that, like at the end of every chorus, I'd be a little bit upset about that. Because now I would have been like, it's a little overused. It loses its shine. They, they only used it at that one spot. So it kept its shine just fine. So yeah, it's a 6.8. It's a pretty good song. You know, I, I don't have any problem with it. I don't have any issue with it. I'm also not going to sit here, though, and blow things out of proportion and go, oh, it's an amazing song when it's clearly not okay but it is a pretty good song and i will actually have no problem giving it the pretty good score of 6.8 i feel good about that score and that's where we're gonna stay so let's wrap everything up here in a nice shiny bow shall we we got a 6.8 which is a pretty good scale rating three out of five stars and a b letter grade take your pick i don't care whichever one of those floats your boat final word final score i have spoken well, that's going to do it for this edition of Reactions, Reviews, and Rants. Hope you all enjoyed the show. Hopefully, I was able to entertain you. If I was able to put a smile on your face and brighten your day, then I did my job, and I'm so glad I could do it. If you guys feel like joining the fan base, go ahead and click on that button down there. If you guys want to like the video, go ahead and like the video. If you guys want to ring the bell, go ahead and ring the bell. It honestly doesn't make any difference at all to me, but if you guys feel like doing these things, well, then by all means, feel free to do so. Well, that's going to do it for the night, folks. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, this is David Heretic signing off, reminding you to stay fabulous and support each other. Later. Peace.